All right. I was thinking about I was thinking about doing this little video clip about the building we live in, about the stoop, and this, that, and the other thing. So let's let's take a little glimpse into a little bit of history and current times right here. We are in the neighborhood. Obviously, when we say the neighborhood, we do mean the neighborhood, and I am still in the neighborhood. It's not the exact block that I grew up on, that I you know that I'm from. A couple miles down the road, maybe a mile and a half down the road is where my spot was, but. Uh, I relocated here about a mile and a half, something like that, down the road. Neighboring city, all right? Here's the situation. Yes, life is better on the stoop. Okay, this is our building, all right? This is our building. And I don't care who knows what and where. It doesn't really matter to me. I fear nobody. Docks, I don't, whatever the fuck. With these people with the docks and this, that, and the other thing. Be that as it may, this is the stoop, all right? We got a couple of chairs. We got the broom to sweep the stoop. To sweep the sidewalk. As you can see, we keep it very clean over here. And we have we hang out out here. I don't always post it, but we hang out out here. We have a cigar. We have a glass of wine. A few of the guys come by. I mean, and we just hang out. So, let's get into a little history right here. Now, we have two. We have the, build, we have the residences up there, right? Down here, we have... Well, you could kind of figure out what that once was. Now, we have one of those on each side. Now, check it out. We have one on that side. We have residents on this side. And then we have another one there. We have two of those. Look at, you can kind of imagine what went on here. So, years ago, this was the card room. This was the card room where we had games. You know, we had games here. Like a little casino almost in there, okay? Back in the day, this is current time. This is old times, years ago. You could see the whole, you can you can get the understanding of what goes on here. This is truly an old school vibe environment here. So on that side, we had the games. There's like a, there's a poker room in there. There was a poker room in there. Now it's offices and stuff, okay? And we move over to this side and we have this here. Okay, this was like a count room, okay? So one of the guys that owned a lot of the businesses in the neighborhood, he kind of, he had, how do I say it? In his name was both of these spots, okay? So he had a few businesses around in the county and the count room would be here, right? And the players would be over here. <laughs> Just giving you a, a history. The players, we would, you know, we would have games here, all kinds of gambling games, poker, blackjack, you name it, whatever. There would be people on the stoop hanging out. Obviously, a few guys having cigars, drinking, whatever, hanging around the neighborhood. All right, so playing cards and casino night over there. And then counting over here. The money went to a different a different residence obvious reasons so a perfect building a perfect location a perfect situation the good thing is about it was there's city parking in the back so there's parking lots in the back and you you, you know way back there's parking lots okay way way back there's parking lots city parking lots so really, really, we can almost leave the street clean with nobody around. <laughs> and I'll show you something else. Give me a second. I'm just giving you a glimpse of how life was once upon a time around here. Now, my, now a, a friend of mine rents both spots for legitimate business. But that's the building. Now, let's go back here. I'm showing you the background. There's my car parked back here. All right, now I'm gonna give you, <laughs> this is pretty interesting. So we also had a back entrance right there with that lock on it, see? It's really, really like 1950 over here. So we had, we had this building here that was the other one, and this is the other one. 
Uh-oh. So then you go from the back. And so both places had a, uh, had a back. And then we have an alleyway, a true alleyway. Once upon a time, this was a window here and they blocked it up, as you can see. But this is the alleyway in between the buildings. This is how close we are to each other. So I just wanted to give you a little bit of an understanding of life around here, how it once was, how it is today. All right. And that's where we're at. Take you right back out to the front. This here, I'm gonna show you something else real quick. This here was a movie house, a true movie house, Franklin Theaters. As you can see, it has that vibe, that look. Still kept the look. They turned it into condos. They still kept that beautiful, that arch. And that's it. That's the back of the building. All buildings, all apartment buildings. That's what life is around here. Let's go back out. So it was a great, great spot. Windows. People would be smoking, so we'd have the windows open on the back side here. We're talking about years ago, guys. Once upon a time in the neighborhood. I figured I'd give you a video, man. You see, you know, why not? History of the neighborhood. True neighborhood, and Tommy Stiggs is still here. Only everybody is legit doing what they do. And there goes the 74 city bus, $1.25 to get you to the local bars. All right, Tommy Stiggs checking out from the stoop.